Hi everyone, I'm Brendan Borther, the Technology Innovation Librarian and Assistant Professor of Law here at Seton Hall Law School. I'm going to walk you through the 10 ish things you need to know from legal computing as you begin your law school career. First, who are we? There's two members of IT here at the law school, Carmela Lobrano, he is the Assistant Dean of Legal Computing, and Lola Mar Mendoza, the Help Desk Support Specialist. These are the two people that will be your go-tos for all of your technology needs over the next three or four years. Where are we? On the fourth floor of our law school is the law library main entrance. If you go to the back of this library to the right hand side within the Rodino reading room, you will find the IT offices where both Lalmar and CARM are located. The next big question is how do I get Wi-Fi? So there's two networks here at Seton Hall Law School. The main one is called Campus. This is where you enter in your short name that you should have received and your Okta password. This will stay connected every single day that you come in. If you choose to do the SHU guest network, you will have to repeat daily the login, but this is where you would enter your phone number, receive a code, text it to you, and then enter the code into the Meraki pop-up on your phone or laptop to get on the Wi-Fi. I get how many copies of Office? Everyone gets six copies of Microsoft 365. So what does this mean is when you go to the Microsoft website and you download it, you get activated through your Seton Hall account. Now, this activation is only good until you graduate and about six months after, but this gives you a copy of Word, PowerPoint, Excel, Outlook, Teams, everything that you could possibly need within the Microsoft 365 suite. What is OneDrive? This is such a big part of our school, is saving all of your documents to a cloud location, whether you use Google Drive, iCloud, or OneDrive, you wanna make sure that all of your school documents, your outlines, your notes, are always being saved online. It's best practice at the beginning of the semester to make sure that the autosave is working on something like Microsoft Word, so that by the end of the semester, you're not desperately trying to figure out what happened to your outline that you worked on for the last four months. What is Teams? This is the other primary tool that we use here at Seton Hall Law School. This is the primary tool for class recordings, meeting virtually with professors, perhaps it's through office hours, perhaps it's through a snow day class, engaging with all of your student organizations that you'll join, and sharing info with your study group. You can also use this to reach out to individuals at the law school. So if you did need tech help that you want to reach out directly to CARM or Lawmar, you can do that through here. What is Canvas? So Canvas is our learning management system, or LMS. This is where your professors will store all of the course documents, mainly the syllabus at the beginning of the semester. You can find out the course schedule on here. Professors will also send out announcements through this. The announcements should end up inside of your email, but they will also be captured and stored on here. So in case you miss one, you can always go back and reference it. How do I print? So here at CN Hall, we have a print software that you will need to download. You'll see the link here. You can also scan this QR code to get it. In addition, copiers are located for students on the third, fourth, and fifth floors of the Rodino Center. Each of these copiers is black and white, and you will go to each copier, either scan your phone, swipe your ID card, and release your print job. You can also make actual copies from this and scan to your email address directly from these machines. So like I said, when you come up to a machine, it's got a nice screen on it. You could log in on the screen using a six digit code, but it's much easier just to scan, swipe your ID card, or use the app on your phone called the Faro Century Print app. It's gray with a nice yellow torch, and you can scan the QR code that you see on this slide and print immediately from any of the copiers in the building. So what are these screens? As you come through the Rodino Center Library, you're going to notice a lot of giant screens. We have them laid out on many tables for all students with cables next to them. These cables plug directly into your Mac or Windows laptop, and you'll get immediately a second screen that you can either mirror or use as a full extended screen. So this way you can do research on these giant screens, having a web browser on one side and a Word document on the other, or compare documents as you go through your law school career. So laptops, 
we do have a few requirements here. They are mainly based on ExamSoft. So this is a program exemplified that you'll use to take all of your law school exams. In order to take a law school exam, you need a laptop that meets the minimum requirements for ExamSoft. So they're there here on the screen. If you have an older Mac book, you'll notice that they only accept Monterey, Ventura, and Sonoma. So you wanna make sure to update your Mac before exams. However, do not update immediately before exams. In the case that your laptop is not fully updated yet, you can always borrow a loaner laptop for each exam. If your laptop is broke, or maybe you just don't trust it for class that week, you can come to the library service desk where you can loan out a laptop for a day or slightly longer until you get your laptop fixed or you start to trust it again. Speaking of the service desk, we have tons more supplies there. So visit us. You can take out everything from umbrellas to mice to phone chargers and even an optical disk drive if you just need to play that hard DVD on your laptop. So please stop by the service desk. We loan out so much more than books. How do I fix this? Never hesitate to stop by or reach out if something goes wrong. If we don't have an immediate solution, we'll get you on the right track. If you ever have ideas, questions, comments, or general ways to make your law school experience better technologically, let us know. We work with students all the time to make sure that you are getting the best you can from your experience here. So that's a lot of information all at once. That's great. Scan this QR code and everything that I said and more will be emailed to you. You just have to scan the code, enter your email address, and hit submit. Thank you so much and welcome to Seton Hall Law School.